Hello. <laughs> Sorry. I unplug my microphone when I'm not using it because I don't trust the internet. Um, and if I don't plug it back in, and sometimes when I plug it back in, OBS is like, who? I don't know her. And I'm like, please, the microphone is plugged in. This is always the default mic. Why are you changing it? But, you know, it is what it is. Uh, hold on, I'm gonna get some music going in the background. Because I was gonna have, like, uh, like a game up, like a placid plastic duck simulator or something, but I couldn't figure out a way to get to the work of my layout, so we're just not gonna do that. And that's Kitty, yeah, that's Sweet Pea. She's a little tortoise shell. Uh, she's like eight or nine, and she's a horrible monster who tried to stand on my head last night while I was sleeping, and it woke me up. But uh, usually I use my webcam as Kitty Cam, and it's like down here next to. Mr. Hoad Coward, but uh, I only have one webcam, so I can't have. I mean, we have Kitty Cam. She's right there, so whatever, right? I don't know exactly how I'm gonna do this because, like, I don't have. Like I said, I have one camera, and I don't want to point it too down because I am not wearing a revealing shirt. But as the absolute legend and icon Finster has, um. Proven having boobs on Twitch is a bit of a touchy subject, so I don't really want to like angle it down too far. <laughs> Especially because then you're not gonna be able to see my face. Um, so I don't know. Oh, and I need to record those with them. Yes, okay, everyone say hi, YouTube. Uh, there's gonna be a lot of new people here because for two in a time, so. Beauty YouTuber, the two. Yeah, I was just like, just, you know, just like, hmm, how are you doing? You know? <laughs> I don't know how they do it. I don't watch beauty YouTubers. I tried to watch them, and the the level of parasocialness was just a little too high for me. Kind of bugging me out. Yeah. Hi, YouTube. Uh, and hi, everyone in chat. Uh, since you guys are new, I'm Lou. Um, you can call me Lou. That's what I usually go by. Uh, we usually play video games here, and I'm actually usually a VTuber. <laughs> um, I am usually a dog VTuber. And, um, but I'm human today, so that you guys can see what I'm doing. Uh, usually I'm down there with the furret on my head, but uh, furret is just gonna... Yeah, re I'm, I'm gonna try to hold it up so you guys can see. I got, like, all the guys on the YouTube videos use, like, chopsticks and a little plate, so I got chopsticks and a little plate. Yeah, I'm... Or just like... So. Yes, we have the two. Um, and yeah. Furret is down there taking the brunt of our, um... Because you can throw things at me. And we even have a special throw things at me redeem just for this stream. Hold on, where is it? We have tuna time. So, there's that now. And since I'm not my VTuber self, Furret will have to take the brunt of the attacks. We appreciate Furret for um, their sacrifice. <laughs> but welcome, everyone. Yes, it is tuna time. What's that yellowfin tuna? I think this is white tuna. I don't know. I didn't know there were so many different kinds. I was like, what's my hair doing? My hair is not the same thing today. I, um, usually when I eat tuna, it's sushi. <laughs> so, um, I, I mean, I like canned tuna. I, I like tuna, uh, I like tuna melts. Part of me was like, I should use this to make a tuna melt, but it's been a really long time. And, um, it's been a really long time since I've had a tuna melt, and the last time I had one I didn't like it very much, but I did get it from, like, from Beyond Bread. And also, it would be disappointing because I can't have gluten, and there's not a lot of good gluten-free bread that I've found. There goes Furry getting bonked. And hello, welcome, yes. Um, a salad that cost twenty dollars. I, I mean, I spent close to thirty dollars on both of these, so like, fuck me, I guess. Um, but yeah, I would feel like I need to get like fancy bread and like fancy cheese, like I can't, or fancy mayonnaise. It's like I can't just make a normal tuna melt, and then we're just breaking the bank. And I don't have good enough gluten free bread. I'm walking like, here. I'm walking here. I'm walking here. That that redeemism because I. I walk places in video games when some people think I should be riding horses. Um, 
I don't believe in riding horses. I believe in walking. And yeah, we're just getting ready. So we got this one, which is the... I have... Yeah, we have a lot of redeems. Because... <laughs> what else am I going to do, really, right? If I don't have my camera. We have to be entertaining. Yeah, we've got... I, I was going to get the oval tin. Because they have, they have a circle and an oval. And, um... But... So this is... The oval tin was seven dollars and fifty cents on Amazon. I didn't want to buy it on Amazon because I was like, just buy it from a store in town. I live in a city. There's got to be like somewhere that's selling this. So I asked my sister where she got it because she lives here too, and she was like, oh, I got Whole Foods. I went to Whole Foods, and this was like six dollars, and the oval can was like fourteen dollars. <laughs> so. This is what we're eating. <laughs> we're eating the round can. And I feel like the the oval can is just going to be too much. That's too much tuna. What am I supposed to do with that much tuna? So, little oval can. Just the regular. Let's see if my camera doesn't want to focus because it was a $20 webcam I got on Amazon. But if that it's in there. Mm. Stay tuned. <laughs> oh my. Sorry if I'm not getting caught up with I usually try to keep a good a good eye on chat when I get distracted sometimes. And yeah, we have a lot of fascinating redeems, most of them involving violence and or um, playing little clips. Yeah, see, Whole Foods is owned by Amazon, so like, why the hell is it, <laughs> is it more expensive than Whole Foods? It should be the same price, but whatever. And then this I did have to buy online because I would not you can see the reflection of the light on my face and how shiny this fucking hey there demons is. it's me your so, boy well, thank you for following welcome in and yeah so we got ortiz ventresca very fancy very shiny as you can see it says it was pole and line caught one by one which is i can understand why it's so expensive that's insane. And, um, it also says somewhere on here that it's dolphin safe. I don't know what that means. Or dolphin friendly? I don't know what that means. Somebody, people were talking about that a lot in the notes of the tuna post. I, I didn't look it up. Shiny fish, yeah. I love the Amazon Beast to be like on that for organic shit that was 10 times surprised. That's the nickname of Whole Paycheck. Yeah, Whole Paycheck, honestly. I only go there because they have the widest gluten-free selection close to my house. If um, if there was anywhere else I could go with actual gluten-free options, like they have gluten-free pasta and chicken nuggets and bread that doesn't suck. It's not good bread, but it's okay. I wouldn't, um, I wouldn't shop there. <laughs> and I only get the gluten-free stuff and then I go to Albertsons for the rest of my food. Uh, Salt to see if things do it, that's not in the shop. Well, I mean, if they're catching it pole on a pole one by one, I mean, how would you catch a dolphin? I don't think you can catch a dolphin like that, so I would assume that it would be dolphin safe, or dolphin friendly. If you were doing like nets, I could see getting some dolphins in there. Yeah. But these, these say, like, it says. You guys probably won't be able to read it. It's not going to focus, but it says. Pull and line pot, one by one. I don't know how... I mean, I... Impressed. I'm impressed. The dedication. So much information on this little box. And most of it's in Spanish. Oh yeah, dolphin friendly. This little seal right here that you're probably not going to be able to read either. It says dolphin friendly. You mean that sticker team tuna are huge? Oh jeez, yeah. I I've seen like yellowfin tuna are like they're the kind that get sold in like Japan for sushi and they're like I bigger than me and they go for like thousands and thousands of dollars. Which is insane. I think albacore tuna are like more regular fish size? But I'm not sure. I'm not a fish expert. I wanted to be a marine biologist when I was a kid, and then I was too bad at math to be a good scientist, so I stopped. Um, I do like dolphins. 
I did also just have a glass of orange juice, and I don't know how that's going to make these taste, so I think I'm going to drink some water. See if we can get the... I have to take orange juice with my iron supplement, apparently, or I won't absorb it. Oh, good. I don't think orange and tuna is going to taste too great together. Also, usually I use a reusable water bottle that's in the wash, that's why I have this. Or I would not be drinking out of a disposable plastic bottle. And I will recycle it, just in case. It seems like sustainability is something we should care about. Usually, I have a water bottle. These stickers on it. I'll have to around three or four feet. Oh, so like, I'm like five feet tall, so that's like... Smaller than me, but not by much. I was gonna try to come up with a fraction, and I can't. Yeah, I could see them getting caught by a pole. Yeah, I'm sure you could do that. I mean, people catch, like, like, giant, massive catfish with their bare hands, so who am I to say what is possible and what is not possible? I just think it seems like it would take a really long time. Like, I don't know how you catch enough to sell it. You know? Like, keep up with demand, but I guess that's why it's so expensive. Yeah, yeah sorry, my mic arm is a little... A little, uh, squeaky. Oh, we're not listening to Undertale. <laughs> sorry, this is my... My chill video game music playlist for when I'm doing, like, Minecraft stuff. And it has a lot of tail on it. How many smaller nuts are not the specific features of all these That's good. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's better. <laughs> and I suppose we should stop putting it off and I should actually try, try the tuna. Yeah, it's also got Stardew Valley on it, like the whole Stardew soundtrack. I love Stardew Valley. I love farming sims. Usually I am being very normal about farming sims on my channel. By normal, I mean not normal at all. Yes, we do love, we love a good farming sim. Okay, I've stalled. My mouth doesn't quite taste as much like orange juice as it did earlier. I got my chips. Weirdly enough, the YouTubers I've been watching who do, like, canned fish stuff, they always have really nice chopsticks. That got... it makes me a little jealous. I wish I had better chopsticks. These are... these are kind of... they're not as nice. That's okay, that's not what it's about. I guess I'm just gonna try to do this where you guys can see, because <laughs> I don't... trimmed all my fingernails recently? That was maybe a mistake. Oh god. Oh, I kind of wanted to make the box, keep the box nice, but that's not gonna happen now. Please? Please give me my tuna? That's a persona music. That's like this. I wanna be- Oh, don't worry, I'm not gonna let her have any. These are in olive oil, and I don't think olive oil is good for cats. Although she might try to come over here, but I'll send her over here. Oh, it does have a design on the can. I was like, it just looks like a flame can, but... It has a little design on the back. That's nice. Olive oil helps with hairballs. She doesn't really have hairballs. I don't know why. She's not one of those cats that has hairballs. Yeah, bad <laughs> music for fighting the cat is doing that. Gonna try to... It shift to something a little more obscure, because I'm actually going to attempt to upload this to YouTube. Congratulations on first Virgil, and also hello. Yes, I will have my Tamagotchi time in a second. Why didn't the trip check image come up before when I was testing redeems? Yeah, that would make sense to loosen it up. Yeah, she doesn't really get hairballs. She only throws up when, like, it's been... No, you. I, I literally just... I haven't even opened... Tuna, if you're Ace and I put a cooldown on Medic. We're gonna be nice and normal in front of the cool Tumblr people. <laughs> it's gonna be normal, god 
damn it. You have not missed the tuna. And don't worry, I'll change it back. I'll change it back when we're not doing this. Hold on, everything's reversed. Fitness but yes. We have tuna. And also, fancy tuna. But we're trying the fancy tuna second, because I'm... I'm gonna be so upset if I hate this, because it was expensive. <laughs> Okay, We're just normal men. We're just normal men. What do you mean, normal men? We're just innocent I men. my engagement ring off because I feel like I'm gonna get it dirty and I don't want to get tuna all over my engagement ring. Oh, keep the horror. I forgot that all of those are gonna be in front of my face. Okay, we're opening it. We're opening the tuna. It smells really good. I don't know what I'm expecting. I hope it's good. I'm worried I'm gonna not like it. It so far just smells like canned tuna. And it didn't wake my cat up, which is good because she actually really does love tuna. It's a... You can kind of see it. It's got the olive oil. On the top here. Why are you beating me? Why are you beating up for it? You're so mean. Throw it screwed through I'll try to throw it. I'll mail it to you. We'll do we'll do like a tournament and we'll mail out the open can of tuna <laughs> to whoever is doing the thing. Yes, it's tuna time. So we're doing the first can. This is just the normal stuff. I sorry I can't show you guys any like I have to stay in frame. Oh, it's kind of compacted, actually. I don't think I can move it like that. Yes, gay. You see? Gay. I don't know that I've ever had tuna in olive oil. I usually get tuna in water, and it's like cheap tuna. I, I don't know that I've ever had fancy ass tuna like this. It smells a lot like tuna. I'm sorry, I need to move this so that I can, you guys are actually have a chance of hearing me and what I'm saying. Gay tuna, unsubbing? Do it, you won't. Okay. Bite of tuna. Try to eat it up. <laughs> I hope not. That's good. It's really good. Medic! Hold on. It's doing things. <laughs> it's not exactly what I imagined, but I've never had tuna in olive oil, so I, I didn't know what to imagine. It's good. It's really good. It's not transcendent, I don't think, but... Hmm. Olive oil tuna go to for real. The olive oil is nice. It's better than water. I like olive oil a lot. So wait, no, add! Oh no, I'll stop eating. I'm sorry. <laughs> is he, you know, a $7 can of tuna? He better be. <laughs> Yeah, I gotta set up the ad manager thing so I can actually snooze them when they come up. I'm very sorry. I encourage ad block, but I know that Twitch is bad about that. I can't tell you how to say it's... Yes, I kind of expected it to be really soft and moist, but it's not. Like, it, it's still... It has the consistency of tuna, but it's not like it's elevated. It's certainly elevated. First cup blood by Nat. I'm so sorry. I hate capitalism. If I could turn off all the ads, I would. I would do it in a heartbeat. Yeah, I'm just. I'm not. I'm not gonna think another thing yet. I'm waiting. And we haven't even gotten to the good stuff yet. And this stuff is supposed to be really good. 
everyone that I saw review both of these said that this was like on another level. Like it, it blows you away. I'm gonna be really disappointed if it's bad. <laughs> or if it's just not as good. Or not, not like... If it doesn't blow my socks off, I'm gonna be disappointed. Yeah, I would've, I would've loved this... This would Mother! be great on some Ritz crackers, actually. But... I can't have Ritz crackers, and I miss them a lot. I actually really like Ritz crackers, I miss them. I wish they could make them gluten free, but I don't think they'd be as good, probably. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. The thing that makes it easier to deal with the fact that I can't what have the dog delicious doing? things with gluten in them is that I know what happens when I eat gluten and I don't want to go through that. But again, it's unpleasant. Mm. And it's enough to remind me that I should, I should not mm. eat the gluten. Last thing with gluten in it I had was a donut from Krispy mm. Kreme, and it was delicious, but it was not good enough to justify what happened to me afterwards. <laughs> yeah, let's try a little bit more. It, it was not fun. I'm not going to explain it. It was gross. Mm. Try two more. E. <laughs> yeah, E. It is really good. This. It is really good. It really is. I think that this would make a phenomenal tuna melt. Why are you giving fur at ADHD? <laughs> I'm kidding, it's fine. Press all the buttons, they're fun. I worked hard on them. Mm. I think that because it has the olive oil. Because mm. it's like... Mm. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Only mm. true old school Tumblr users will know that. Mm. <laughs> I remember that post mm. going around back when I was We're in high school. Just normal men. Oh my god. Right. What do you mean normal just men? Time. We're just innocent men. <laughs> ah! like, if I had... Moron. I, I would want to get really good olive oil, or not olive oil, really good, um, yeah, crap. <laughs> <I'm so sorry. laughs> we have a lot of fun buttons here. <laughs> I'm, I'm, a, I'm a bit of a, a clown. I don't usually do stuff like this, like I said, I, I'm usually a dog YouTuber. Are they really li well, I'm kind of far away from my mic, not gonna lie. I'm sorry if they're really, they're louder than me. I try turning them down. I'm really far away from my mic so that I have room to like, eat. But... I'm so sorry. Is this better? <laughs> Let's just scoot in. I'd be really close to the microphone so that people can hear me, and I'll maybe turn the gain up just a little. And if I peek, I peek. No, Nightbot, stop begging for money. <laughs> this tuna was subsidized by people on Tumblr. And I'm very touched. And it's Yotsuba. Yeah, I got the game right there. I have a messed up back. This is like the only chair that they had at Best Buy. But, or did I get this at Best Buy? I don't remember. I think I got this at Office Max, actually. It's a good chair. It'd be cooler if it was pink or something. Yes, hi, Shen. Shen's working, unfortunately. As I was saying... Tuna usually has this, like, very fishy taste, and, like, I don't mind that so much, but I know that some people would bo would be bothered by it. It was Office Max, okay. And work does indeed suck. It does, but unfortunately, money. And we can't all be cool enough to make absolutely no money streaming Twitch <laughs> like I do. <laughs> 
No tuna can giveaway. I, it, I did really spend all my money on this. I will say it, I spent. I'm a little broke now. I'm live. I am. It's, it's tuna time. We're 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 on this one right now. We're on the regular one. We're eating the tuna. And now it's pig stuff too. Like, straight from Tumblr. Welcome in. I'm assuming most people here are straight from Tumblr. I got olive oil on the can. Don't worry about it. Um. <laughs> yeah, don't worry. Pig step, my beloved. We do love pig step. Tumblr. I always post my links to Tumblr. What are you talking about? Oh my god. Happy Halloween. A straight from Tumblr? Impossible. Everyone on Tumblr's gay. <laughs> Oh god. But okay, tuna has that kind of like fishy taste. And I think it's more pronounced with the cheaper stuff that I've had. This is like this is classy. This is like a subtle She's like she's in a she's in a silk dress, you know? I am a last buy. <laughs> you rum. <laughs> I'm also bi. Congratulations. I mean usually I my little VTuber has buttons, but I'm I'm also very bi. This is just the flag that I have. I think fish is supposed to be fishy. You're not wrong, but it's like there's a difference between like it's fishy and it's hitting it's like hitting you really hard and it's fishy and it's like flirting with you at the bar. You know? <laughs> Does that make any sense? <laughs> I don't know. It's it's a different it's a different vibe. And it's got this like cooked taste to it? I mean, it is good. No, heart, thank you. It's fine. I don't make sense to myself either. It's cooked, but like... I mean, it's all cooked. Canned tuna is cooked, but like... I feel like you can taste the cooking process. I told you they don't let dogs go to school. Haven't you seen the peanuts? They just kick Snoopy out every time. It's so messed up. It's good. This is really good. I can see why it's so expensive. This would be like perfect for the world's most expensive tuna melt. Like it doesn't just taste like it got put in a big pot. And then somebody just flipped a button. And it all got cooked. It tastes like a meal. Chen did say hi, and also he's working. He popped in and said things. That fight on TV or refund, whatever. Nope. I don't remember how the requests do works. <laughs> I actually can't find it. <laughs> Sorry. Doesn't look like it's here. I'll just read that. No, he's just said things to say hi to me. That that's fair. I'm sorry. I don't want to go to San Francisco Rice with tomorrow. It's it's pretty good. But like, if I was gonna make a tuna melt out of this, I would definitely want to get like. Really good mayonnaise and really good cheddar cheese and like nice bread. <laughs> Hello at everyone, especially at Swamping. Thank you, Shen. Appreciate it. It's good. I can definitely eat the rest of this can for sure. It is enjoyable. Yeah, I think this would be good with like go to the cheese counter at the supermarket. Or like the fancy cheese area instead of the regular cheese area. Get some like really good cheddar. Miracle whip on it, God no. <laughs> I mean, live your best life. Do whatever you want, but <laughs> I hate miracle whip so much. I don't know why people like it. I'm a mayonnaise bitch. I really am. Oh god. Fucking hold on. There it goes. Eating up for it. 
What did Furret ever do to you? No, not this again. You guys were doing this yesterday. <laughs> or not yesterday, on Monday. Oh god. I'm still not playing a game, so... Probably won't miss anything in chat. Yeah, it's good. It's- it's got... It's got more of like an act- what, what happened? Still fixing me. Save the game. I would love to. But unfortunately, Aww. IRL, uh, life does not- IRL life. Real life does not allow for save states. No, we're still in Tuna 1. So we did... Or... See, I mangled the box really bad trying to get it open. I'm not good at opening boxes or letters, but this is, this is what we tried. We had the just regular. This stuff was... Like, six... Like, rounded up to six dollars at... Whole Foods. I don't know how much it is other places. And this is the Tuna Belly stuff, which I haven't opened yet. And this was twenty-one dollars on Amazon. <laughs> And the box got really beat up, too. Hold on. I don't know if you can see, like, the quarters are all messed up. I don't know what happened to this in the mail. Somebody punted it at a window or something. Hey, demons. It's me. Your hey! Boy. <laughs> Welcome in. I recognize that username. Hello. Oh my god. The spam. I'm sorry. My chat is, uh... My chat likes to misbehave and ruin my emote statistics or something, but so far, yeah. Two and a one. Okay, <laughs> see if it's making Twitch glitz, maybe we cut back with the, the emote spam a little bit, guys. <laughs> Imported from the Basque country group, right? I... I mean, it seems like someone ported it right through my, like, a window, the way that this box looks, but we'll see. I wonder if it says. No, this is all in Spanish. I don't speak Spanish, and the little Spanish that I do speak is um, Mexico Spanish, not Spain Spanish, because uh, I live near Mexico. Product of Spain. It just says Spain. <laughs> Fancy. Unlurk! Welcome back, James. Got it out of your system? Okay, good. I'm glad you got it out of your system. It's good. I think I think we will try the other one, although I am gonna try to wipe up some of this. Oh my god. No, everyone's gonna... Everyone's gonna know that I like One Piece. <laughs> They're all gonna know that I'm a loser. I'm kidding. One Piece is based. I'm just trying to wipe off the bottom of this can. And then... Maybe wipe off the plate a little, because I got olive oil on it. Which was bound to happen. Yeah, anyone who follows me for any amount of time would very quickly find out that I like One Piece. Not my fault, though. I got bullied into liking it. Can't have anything. Without your friends being like, why aren't you reading One Piece? And then not leaving me alone until I read it. Me. I did not bully myself into it. You bullied me into it. <laughs> the One Piece is real. I don't know that that's how it's spelled. <laughs> European Unmade. That's valid. Oh, Basque Country is in Spain. Ah. Yes. We have people who are European in my chat, I believe, quite, quite often, but I haven't been to Europe since I was six. And I didn't even get to go to Spain. I went to France. <laughs> oh, you don't have receipts. You have your memory. Anecdotal evidence. That is not admissible in court. <laughs> Hello from Ireland. Yeah, see, there we go. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> what? Yes, okay, fine. I bullied myself into getting into One Piece. Shen took advantage of this. Because he saw a weakness. And I like One Piece. What more do you want? What do you want? I did! I just said that I bullied myself into it! 
Shen always comes over here to argue. Because <laughs> he can hear me talking. We don't have a big house. We live in a one bedroom. So My office, if you couldn't tell, is our back patty. Well, it's not patty. It's like a storage room. I don't know. But yes, okay. We, we're, it's tuna time. We're going to keep going with the tuna. Oh, Shen came over here and I didn't even ask if he wanted any tuna. <laughs> He doesn't. Unbelievable. Not even any of this fancy tuna belly? This is a crazy stuff. Let's see. So Ventresca is like the tuna belly, I'm, I've been told. Yeah, that's Snoopy. Snoopy's sleeping on the bed because I cleared it off. We wouldn't have kitty cam. And I know she likes sleeping on the bed, so. Never right, Snoopy. Oh, she felt for you. Opened her eyes a little. She likes hanging out back there. She's a CPPP. She is kitty. Anyway, we're opening this one now. Because I promised the people to an attack. So this, I, I will say, is the best canned tuna I've ever had. The only kinds of canned tuna I've eaten is like bumblebee and chicken of the sea and stuff, but this is better than that by a lot. It's not exactly what I expected. I expected it to be a little more moist and like a little, a little smoother, I don't know. But it's really good and I would love to make a tuna melt with it. And I mean, I could still. Apparently, you can save these for up to a week. You just have to make sure that it's completely covered in olive oil and then put it in the fridge. Um, I don't remember which box that was on. Medic! I don't believe that it's on this box. What is it? This one also does not say. Where did I read that? Did I hallucinate? I'm losing my mind. Heal! What am I supposed to heal? I'm not playing a video game. I can't fix myself in real life. I have to go to the doctor for that. Oh my god. Shout out to Ad Pinky Dragon for drawing these adorable tama tama Tamagotchi of me. <laughs> that is now being hurled at for it. <laughs> Might have been- no, I swear to god I read it on the box. <laughs> oh no wait, here it is. I'm just stupid. Once opened, keep the tuna refrigerated and submerged in olive oil, refilling if necessary. For full flavor, consume within five days. So if I don't eat all of this, I can keep it. But that's this one. This box does not say anything like that, so... I feel Kale. like this one is like a... You open it and you eat it. Give the bits. Oh my the god. Bits. <laughs> oh no! For it! Okay, okay. Take it yeah, easy I, on the counter. Yeah, I figured you? out that you can make these stay now instead of um, them just vanishing. Well, because what was I supposed to put down there? What was I supposed to put? I don't have anything else. <laughs> Hold on, I'm doing something real quick. Yes. Pinky Dragon is a person who drew my adorable little Tamagotchi. You should follow her. Also a VTuber. Why are, is this box closed so tight? What are you guys trying to protect? It's in a can. <laughs> I feel so bad. I wanted to keep these boxes, kind of, but... Yes, we're gay. They're protecting the can, obviously. Goodbye, box. 
This one also has a little design on the front. See, this is what the other, the oval can size is. So I'm kind of glad that I didn't get the oval can and I got the circle one instead because I don't know what I'm going to do with two of these. <laughs> that too many times now but yeah so this is an artisan product oh it's the lot number okay that's fine and uh yeah this is supposed to be the really really fancy good stuff this was this was this was 21 dollars <laughs> actually it was 20 dollars and like 30 cents but whatever this is the one I'm scared that I'm not gonna like. Cause, uh, but also, I'm I'm getting my sister one of these for her birthday because she's the one who told me about this tuna. It really is. Okay, I'm opening it. Tuna time. Oh god. Hold on. Are you hitting for it? Okay, so it still smells like canned tuna. That's something. Ah. Oh, the frogs! God, that's my favorite redeem still that I've ever made. I just got olive oil all over my hand. I'm gonna run out of napkins. This is a lot of tuna smell, I have to say. I'm not a huge fan of the way tuna smells. I like the way it tastes. The smell is a little much sometimes, which is weird because it's like I don't actually dislike the fishy smell of fish. I really like seafood. I was, I grew up landlocked, but I, um, my grandpa was in the Navy and, um, from Maine, Not it! New England. And so I, um, was give, was blessed with a appreciation of seafood of all sorts. And I also just like eating things. So I like seafood. But yeah, the, the fishy smell of tuna is just a little bit much for me sometimes. Or it's a Pokemon, so like, it's just in battle. Pokemon like battling. Stop making me drink water. I don't even like Dasani water anymore. I did before this. Before I had to start drinking it all the time. Now I'm a little over it. I miss my Brita filter water, but I'm gonna try to make let you guys look at this. Here. Tuna. It doesn't look very good because my camera is very cheap. <laughs> my camera cost only three dollars more than this can of tuna. That is sad. But it's like in these like slices, these like ribbons. You know, what? I'm gonna take a picture of this. Aww. Post alongside the YouTube, because this is getting close it! on the tunnel, tunnel that hill. Ooh, that's pretty actually. This looks so much prettier. Gorgeous, you're gorgeous, Miss Tuna. <laughs> How does it taste? Not so good, I would think. <laughs> We're also probably gonna play Skyrim after this, just so you guys know. I have a very modded Skyrim file we've been playing, which is fun, but two in a time right now. I don't know, I thought it would be softer and less firm, but it's pretty firm. My chopsticks suck. I need new chopsticks. Oh my god. Oh my god, can I please have some tuna? Holy shit. This is more difficult than it needed to be. Why is my hair on the plate? Zero to ten, do not recommend having hair. <laughs> Eat the camera next on it, definitely. You know, it's it's not actually cake, you know, not everything. <laughs> Tastes pretty good if you don't have hay fever, you know, you're not supposed to eat grass, that can mess up your teeth. Is what I heard, it's not good for you. I'm working on it! Don't yell at me about the tuna. 
these shitty chopsticks. So they they're like in strips like this, you can see. And it's like it looks fattier, I have to say. But it still smells like tuna. Not I like tuna, but I'm not the biggest fan of the way it smells. What the fuck? <laughs> that is something else. That is something else entirely. I don't- I'm a writer and I don't even have, like, words. Like, hold on. The flavor, the the tuna flavor is a little more pronounced. Three high pixels, welcome in. You're, you're we're eating the fancy tuna. Haruhi or on high school host club would be proud. So the the first can, the cheap the cheaper stuff, cheaper in comparison, it was pretty good. This is the expensive stuff is like I need to think about it. I didn't actually know that, because I don't look at my view count while I'm streaming, but thank you. It's okay. You can tell me. <laughs> I don't even know how to describe the way this tastes. It's like... It's tuna. That's definitely tuna. It almost has like a seaweed flavor like just at the end. Which is like a seaweed taste right there. You can even taste the ocean for a second. It's very rich. It's very rich. <laughs> yeah, Tumblr did jump on the bandwagon to make me get fancy tuna. I... It's good. It's different. I don't know that I would make this into a tuna melt. I wouldn't know what to do with this at all. The crackers, maybe, I guess? Well, peer pressure is cool, you should succumb. I wanted to do this anyway. Somebody just gave me permission and money, so. 15k notes? It said like 35. <laughs> you guys don't spend enough time on Tumblr. Or you spend a healthy amount of time on Tumblr, and I spend too much time on Tumblr, which is true. But I don't have a job, so. This is my job, actually, legally. <laughs> Twitch streaming is my job. My life is a joke. <laughs> I don't have an actual following on Tumblr, I've only got like 8,000 followers, and I've had this blog for like 12 years, so that number is skewed. <laughs> this is like... This is very rich. Most tender, delicate cut of all, we preserved it in fine form. Olive oil. Pleasure which is prized by the most expert palates, <laughs> says Amazon. I'm sure that's what Amazon says. I have 1,300 followers on Twitter and it's rapidly going down. Well, that's because of what's going on with Twitter. <laughs> but again, I've had my Tumblr for like, uh, since like, yeah, it's been about 12 years. I think I've had it since 20, the beginning of 2012 was when I, like, January. No, February. Oh, no, wait, no, I remember. It was February, the last day of the month, because I got that year, it was a leap year, and I started my vlog on the leap year day, which is why I didn't get my 10-year notification that my vlog is 10 years old, <laughs> because according to Tumblr's thingies, it's a leap year baby, and therefore it's not, <laughs> even though it is. Top. Tumblr appreciates the fact that I talk too much and that I'm very funny. 
Am- or not Amazon, I'm sorry. Twitch appreciates the fact that I'm a dog and plays video games. Jesus Christ. Like, it's almost too much. It's like... Like, I can only eat, like, half a slice at once. <laughs> I think that if you ever have it within your means to try this, you absolutely should. The expensive one. Yes, the best accompaniment for tuna. Dasani water. Hashtag not sponsored. It's not, it's really not. Tumblr's here for tuna shenanigans, and that's fine. I think I need my Sprite, actually. Because, <laughs> like, this is so rich and so, like, it's like the oil and the mm. fat. Oil is fat, but, you know, like, the oil and then the fish fat is, like... probably should have skipped taking my fish oil pills today, actually. <laughs> I feel like I don't need them after this. Yeah, it's, like, it's really rich. I feel like if you were going to... You either should just eat this on its own, or you would need to put it in something that has, like, some citrus or something to kind of, like, mellow it out just a little. Just so it doesn't hit you quite as hard. You think Tumblr's not here to bully the dog tuber? You're funny. <laughs> That's the best description of my online presence that anyone's ever written. And it's so funny that I've only written two fanfictions that have Lame Miz lyrics as titles. <laughs> and Pixels is never gonna let me live it down. It is right on the line between yellow and green, and that is the final thing. That is my final stance on the color of Gatorade. Aaron is very shaped. You know what it is? It's not a very good color. It's kind of ugly. <laughs> it's the color of white grapes. Which, but not quite, because white grapes are like in the same category, but they look a little bit better. But here's the thing, is you call those green grapes, but when it's Gatorade, it's yellow. Make it make sense. Is trying to drown me, by the way. Write more so we can make a funny video out of it. I'm too busy to write. I think I am gonna go get my sprite, though. <laughs> He's just so baby girl shaped. He is a 145 year old demon, but I guess he can be a baby girl, too. I don't remember what his age is. I don't know what I said that it was. <laughs> I know when he got trapped. But I don't know when he was born. Summon? Manifested? Anyway. The bullying Twitch streamers is always morally acceptable. You are correct. That is what Twitch is for. Bullying people. This is so rich. It's so good, but oh my god, I think if I ate this entire can, I'd have to go take a nap. <laughs> Which, I do need to eat this entire can, because I spent money on it. <laughs> the guy in the video I watched just sat there and ate the entire contents of both of these cans, and it's like... How do you eat that much oily fish all at once? Without, again, needing to take a nap. I don't know, maybe he takes a nap when the camera's off. Cat behavior? You're not wrong. If this wasn't in olive oil, I would give sweet pea some, but it's in olive oil, and I don't think olive oil is good for cats. Also, I don't want her to get it in her head that she's allowed to have human food, because... She already doesn't have any boundaries when it comes to trying to steal food that she wants. I don't want it to get any worse. It's fine for cats? 
I mean, I'm gonna have to look that up. Not that I don't trust Twitch chat, but... I don't want to make her sick, because she just throw up, and I, I have to clean the throw up. Well, I make sure I'm clean the throw up off, because I have really bad back and bad knees, so I'm hard to get down on the ground. And I don't want to make sure I'm clean up cat throw up. I also don't want her to throw up on her bed. Like, on me. There's just so much flavor right up front. Like, it's salty, it's tuna, there's that leftover flavor of, like, being cooked, but, like, in a good way. I forgot someone she's having trouble. Huh. I might give her some later, then. But also, again, I don't want her to get into her head that she can have people food. And she really likes tuna, because, like, she has allergies. Some mystery environmental allergy, and, um... I have to give her allergy medicine, but it's impossible to pill her because she's a monster. So, um, they can have it in small amounts, okay. And she's a monster. So I have to grind up her pills and put them, mix them in wet food, and the only wet food that she'll eat is tuna flavored. And not even to, she has to eat specifically the, not the pate, it has to be the, the chunks. And it has to be tuna. She doesn't like the salmon, she doesn't like the chicken, she doesn't like any of the other flavors. She only eats the tuna. And she will not touch the pate, it has to be a chance. She is a picky monster. I don't know what's wrong with her. She tastes like tuna or something, gonna go back to rereading it. It's a sliver of my day to Godspeed. Yeah, Godspeed, Pixels, good luck. It's good, but it's like... I really have to go slow on this game. This is intense. I'm feeding a bird. So Medic! I think it's perfect. I really do. But it is like it's intense. It's it's a lot. No problem. Thank you so much for stopping by. I hope this has helped you decide if you want to buy fancy cans of tuna or not. <laughs> yeah, I don't have, like, I, I just, I don't know. It's really good, but it's just, like, it's not like anything that I've tasted before. Thank you for the banana. I don't have any bananas to eat. It is still dry enough that I do need to drink something when I'm eating it, though. Oh my god, did I remember to hit play on the captions again? This? I did not remember to hit play on the captions. I'm sorry, I will be better. <laughs> it's like, it's good, but I have to go this slow because I need my stomach to settle in between. I feel like I'm eating butter. Like, just straight butter. <laughs> it's a little fishy, but in a good way. I think it kind of... It's it's like, it makes me think it was cooked over, like, a fire. I mean, it, you know, I don't know what how it was cooked. But it has that kind of cooked over campfire taste just a little. Just, just a smidge. Or, like, maybe they cooked it over a gas range or whatever, but it, it, it tastes in a good way. I would love to watch a video on how this is made. I really would. It is good. I think I am going to have to call my sister and ask her to come and take this off my hands. <laughs> I just don't know if I can eat this entire can myself. I know she'll take it though. She's very anti-food waste, so if I have any leftovers, she'll just come steal them. I wonder where they got the olive oil from. That's something I'm curious about. I like all I'm I really like olive oil. Which I think is part of the reason I like this a lot. And it makes me wonder like what kind of olive oil they're using. 
Since this is artisanal stuff from Spain, I'm assuming they're using like fancy olive oil from like Italy or whatever. It's so good, but it's like god. It really does feel like I'm just eating butter. Mm. It's really good. Jesus Christ. I don't know that I- I'm trying to think of, like, anything else to say. Like, the guys who reviewed it have more experience reviewing canned fish, I guess, than I do. Yeah, it's like, it, it's- it's really good. And it's heavy. Heavy. Let me go back and taste the other stuff, because it doesn't taste anything. Well, it- it has the same cooked taste that I'm tasting, but like, this was on like a fire or something, this was like cooked, and it, it tastes like it was cooked, whereas the other tunas I've had kind of just taste like tuna. It's like there's no remnant of the cooking process, I don't think, it's super noticeable. But these both have that, but... This one is like, it hits you with just all this umami, salty, fishy flavor and then the oil and it's really good and then it just settles out and it's like, cool. That's fish, man. Meanwhile, this does not, th this kind of is a light, lighter hitter. This isn't in the heavyweight category like, like the other stuff is. This stuff is just like, that's some good tuna. This, I would make into a really nice tuna melt. This other stuff, I feel like you just gotta crack it out at a party and get some crackers and stuff. Like, I don't see... I don't see, um, myself, like... Come on any, like, it's too nice to do anything with. <laughs> this stuff is not too nice to do anything with. This is perfect for... Just, like, the... The fanciest tuna melt you possibly fucking think of. Hmm. Yeah, you'd really want to get good olive oil. Not olive oil, I'm sorry. Good mayonnaise. Good bread. Really nice cheddar cheese. How, what else do you put in a tuna melt? Do you put like celery in the in the mayonnaise and the salt and pepper? Oh, and you want to do like fresh ground pepper too. Like if I was going to use this to make a tuna melt, I would have to go all out. I don't know why everyone's going I'm not in charge of everybody else. I'm just here. I don't usually stream up today, but I did the ER yesterday with migraine, so that was fun. By fun, I mean it was not fun. I got poked. They stole my blood. Actually, they didn't steal my blood. They put stuff in my blood. And it made my migraine go away, more or less. And then it came back, and then I took some other medicine and felt better. I'm okay now. Migraines. Zero out of ten. Do not recommend. Also, oh my god, I have been live for an hour. I should probably... As much as I don't mind continuing on with the tuna thing, I want to upload this to YouTube. And I don't edit my videos when I upload them, so I don't want to, like... I don't want the YouTube portion of this to be too long. So we might start wrapping up the tuna stuff. Especially because I can't think of anything else to say. It's just like, it's good. It's really good. Seven dollars good? For a special occasion? Yeah. Yeah. This is the best, th this is the best can, like, regular can tuna I have ever had in my life. Yep, it's good end stream. <laughs> no, I'm gonna play Skyrim. <laughs> I'm gonna play some video games. It's me. Charlie Balloon, thank you for the Your follow. Boy. I appreciate it. Yeah, this. This is best Cantoon I've had. And I don't even know how to classify this. This is maybe some of the best fish I've ever had in general. I haven't had a lot of super fancy fish. Um, and my pet. I will pet Spooky. I will pet the kitty. Don't worry. 
she's adorbs. But she's also very seepy. She's a little eepy baby. She's had a very long day of splashing bandits and needs to go Betty bye. <laughs> oh, you get tired of that video. Oh god, that video. So yeah, final thoughts. This is worth it for a special occasion. If you want to make just the balls to the wall, best fucking tuna melt in the entire world, do it. It's worth it. Or like the best tuna salad you've ever had. Absolutely. If we want to go fancy, we're gone fancy. This is like, sometimes I get, you know, prosciutto. And, and it's expensive, but I like it and it's fine. That's where this is. I think that if you really are just, you want to try the good stuff, do it. Just go in prepared. And I, I, again, I can't imagine doing anything with this other than just eating it. It feels sacrilegious to think about putting, like, mayonnaise on this or, like, salt and pepper. It's already pretty salty. This doesn't need more salt. If you put this in a tuna salad sandwich, it, you don't need to season it. This is so much flavor. I thought of a funny news to share. Oh god, I'm scared. Yeah. They're both a solid 10 out of 10, and they're worth the price. I can see why they cost as much as they do, especially if they are not caught with nets, like it says on the box. And if they are dolphin friendly, they do their best not to accidentally catch dolphins. That's also good. It's imported from Spain. I saw people in the notes of the post saying that it's a lot cheaper in Spain. <laughs> so if you live in Spain, congrats! Screw you. Enjoy your fancy tuna. Being close enough to Italy that you can go have a real pesto whenever you want. Lucky bastards. Well, not whenever you want, but you could go have real pesto. Some plus real cat got the news for the first time in a while. Aw, that's really sweet. Yeah, I've heard that a lot of the plastic waste in the ocean is also fishing nets, so I think the fact that this is not caught with nets is... That's... Um, good sustainability if that is something you care about, which there's no ethical consumption under capitalism, but also it's good to try to be sustainable when we can. Like I said, I'm not usually drinking out of a single-use plastic bottle. I got my water bottle. I got a hydro flask. Yeah, these are ni nice treats, nice treats. I do think I am going to call my sister and ask her if she wants these, because... I don't know that I can finish that by myself, because I'm also a very light eater. I don't eat, like, big, big hearty meals. I get, I get full really fast. Um. And I'm guessing I can just... It says on the box if you just fill it up with olive oil and put it in the fridge. It's fine. Yeah. I'm, I'm definitely really glad I didn't get the oval can size of this, because that just would have been too much. That would have been crazy. My mother decided to be a best friend. I am, but I'm afraid to be but she was fighting with the cats. Oh, jeez. The kitties, they are filled with malice and violence. I'd ask Shen if he wants any of the fancy stuff, but I'm pretty sure I just remember he doesn't like fish that much. So. And this is fish. There's no getting around it. This tastes like fish. I like fish. And that's perfectly fine. If you don't like fish, I don't think you'll like these. Because <laughs> when you get artisanal enough, it's kind of hard to deny that it's, it is what it is. Because that's the appeal. You know? Yeah, I was going to try to get my sister one of these for her birthday, but given the fact that I definitely do not think that I could eat a can of this without going into, like, ending up in the hospital, probably. <laughs> I am. Uh, I'm just going to get this to her, and I'm sure she'll just eat it. Although I'll probably also have a little bit more, too. So, yeah. Sorry if it was a little anticlimactic. But, I mean, we have been here for, like, an hour and 25 minutes, so... A lot I would be good on some crackers. I wish I could eat some crackers with this.
Gluten for crackers just don't usually do it for me because gluten free pastries are kind of crumbly in a bad way. Because there's no gluten to hold the damn thing together. I know enough about baking to know that that's what the gluten is for. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I can eat any more of this right now. I'm gonna die. So we're probably gonna move on for two minutes of time. I wanna thank the Academy, my family, and my family. Thank everyone on Tumblr who reblogged that post, and to the person who tipped me the $24 so that I could get the fancy stuff, and the person who sent me $7 on it, um, I have to. and the person who donated $7 on my Kofi to cover the other. So, like, technically I didn't actually have to pay for these because the internet was wonderful, and they paid for the fancy dinner for me. I'm sure my sister is going to love these. I'm sure she'll say something funny about it that I can share with you guys. Um, thank you to everyone who followed. I got a lot of followers from that tuna post. I appreciate it. But also, if you decide to unfollow because you were just in it for the tuna, no hard feelings. I'm not obsessed with my follower count. I don't care. Thank you for sticking around. I'm all for curating your internet experience. And um, if you do want to stick around, like I said, usually I'm a VTuber. I'm about to go back to being a VTuber. <laughs> Play some Skyrim, which is what we usually the kind of things we do around here. Minecraft, Skyrim, Stardew Valley, Coral Island, Dark Souls, Bloodborne. Video games. So I'm a certified gamer doggo. Baby. And so yeah, if that's your kind of jam and you want to stick around, I'd love to have you. And um Yeah, that's basically that. Um Probably gonna go to BRB real quick while we, uh, wrap up the tuna. Dog plays video games? Yeah, dog can't read, but dog is really good at playing video games, don't worry. Yeah, probably gonna go to BRB. <laughs> Follow and subscribe. And, um, and then we're gonna swap over to Skyrim. So, thank you guys so much. Tuna time was a lot of fun. I had a lot of fun. I'm sure my sister will appreciate these. Even though they've already opened them, I know that she's still gonna eat them. She's not gonna care. I'll put them in, like, a plastic bag and, like, wrap them up and everything. So, yeah, um, good time to get some, get a drink, stretch, you know, do what you gotta do, all that fun stuff, go to the bathroom, get a snack, head out if you got somewhere to be, don't worry about it, we'll be here. I'm gonna get back to Skyrim, but just punching. <laughs> just punching, because <laughs> I, I thought it'd be fun, and it is fun. And that's what we're gonna do. So yeah, enjoy the BRB screen. Uh, I'm just gonna go wrap up all this and turn myself back into a dog. And uh, yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Also enjoy the BRB screen because it's one of my favorite things on my stream and I really like it. So <laughs> I hope you guys like it too. All right, goodbye.